uh, <clears throat> looks like I got egg on my face. I might call this a uh, egg on my face too. Uh, forgot my wife's birthday, but I'll make up for it later. Uh, anyway, I, my, I said my son built his house, but he built it with his own hands, two hands. Just to uh, give you a little story about that. He built it with his own two hands. Uh, and it's a two-story, a real nice, a little nice house. But uh, anyway, I forget where I left off. I said I'd call this egg on my face, too, because uh, I found out, you know, I forgot something real important. March 1st, my wife's birthday. But I hope I can make up for it, you know. In about six months it'll take, but I, I'll still make up for it. All right, let's see. Let me go. I left off at uh, this this man, uh, Agrippa. Agrippa. This I studied this earlier today, and this man Agrippa was interested in Paul. He wanted, you know, I believe in my opinion, <clears throat> he was a a regenerate man, yet unconverted. Uh, and he was really interested in this, in this Paul and, uh, he recognized truth when he heard it and he, he brought, you know, he brought him before him and he said, oh, you can talk all you want to. And so many words, <laughs> give, give us your story. So Paul lets into this beautiful discourse about his whole story. And, uh, I imagine a group of, this is what I said, you know, you can imagine the way you want to, but I don't know exactly what happened, but. Agrippa, you know, uh, he listens to all of the story. And uh, uh, he, uh, I imagine when he got through that he was, you know, all this time he's saying, well, I don't, I don't I want to turn this man loose. And anyway, to make the long story short, and the long and short of it, he, uh, at the end of the thing, Paul got through, he said, uh, uh, I sure wish you, he hadn't appealed to Caesar. Did he appeal to Caesar? Wrong? Yeah. Because uh, I wanted to let him go. He wanted to let him go bad. But uh, he had to turn the next day. He had to turn him. I think he, he turned him over and they went on the ship. Of course, that was, of course, that was predestined because that great journey that he made, the shipwreck and all the miracles that happened. And it was just, uh, it was meant to be, but, uh, he wanted to turn him loose. He didn't see anything, any guilt in him. In fact, I think that he was a, a, a regenerated child of God. And he said, he said, Agrippa said, almost thou hast persuaded me to be a Christian. And Paul said, I would to God that not only thou, but also all that hear me this day were both almost and altogether such as I am, except for my bonds, you know. You know, he, he's, you know, the gripper was beginning to see, say. We don't know what happened to him, but, you know, I believe he was a child of God, in my opinion. But uh, he wanted to turn him loose. Didn't, those aren't attributes of a dead alien sinner. And, uh, but anyway, that's what I, I see in that one. And I want to say something about the flat earth community at large. I know there's a couple of ringers that the, they throw in there, the powers that be. But for the most part, what I found, just from uh, going around and, and listening, you know, you find all kind of them. Everybody's got a different, uh, most of them are believers in Christ that I found. I'd say a great number of them. But, uh, you know, there's others that don't believe, you know, and but they're just as nice as they can be every time I find one. And I'm saying that uh, that these people are friendly people in the flat earth community. I tell you, that, to me, I've been around the ones in the uh, uh, so-called Christendom, and, and they all stuck up, kind of, you know, most of them, not all of them, you know. But, uh, a lot of them are just uh, you know, self-righteous, you know. But in this in this flat earth community, I'm finding people that are just as kind as they can be. I like them. I hope I can be half as friendly as they are. You know. 
none of this stuff is rubbed off on me in the uh, <laughs> religious world. But anyway, uh, uh, that's over in Proverbs eighteen twenty four. You, uh, yeah, the people show themselves friendly. Yeah, that's what's going on. They're showing themselves friendly, and uh, that's really all I had to say today. I can't get into anything else much except, but I got to get in here and start. Uh, making up for that uh, forgotten uh, her, her uh, birthday, March 1st. I've been forgetting it every year, you know. I don't know why. It's a terrible thing. But uh, I get my mind on something else and I can't remember it. But I didn't mean any evil by it. But uh, I can say I'll make up. It'll take a few months, but I'll make up for it. All right. See y'all next time.